What's up guys and welcome back. <laughs> I guess Sackboy is ready for a nap, but we're not because we're playing some more Little Big Planet PSP. Welcome back guys. Today we're going to be continuing on with the new area that we entered in the last episode. I already forget the name, but that's okay because we're going to be hopping back in in just a second or two. Ready, set, go. All right then, so it is of course the Orient by Empresario. In the last episode we got chased by a dragon and then the dragon explained that he's just trying to get his child. It's an awkward situation to be honest. So why don't we go ahead and enter the next level, which is Egg Extraction by Emperor Sario. Let's head in. Ooh, this looks a lot like the Little Big Planet One uh, Islands area. I remember what it was called as the Islands in Little Big Planet One. My egg is in Emperor Sario's palace. He means to use it to make dragon egg fried rice. Wow, that's okay. That's a little out there. I mean, I think the Emperor could have pieced together why, why he, the dragon didn't like him. Please return it to me. I will, honestly. You know, I'm totally on your side. I, if I laid eggs, I totally wouldn't want somebody scrambling them. I mean, that's just why you don't eat eggs, dude. <laughs> Let's go ahead and go through here, and so is this gonna be, this honestly, oh, yep, it's definitely giving me the feel like the islands gave me, which is incredibly difficult going into palaces with a lot of platforming and difficult enemies to fight, ow, with electric powers. All right then, so the they're just sort of swinging and getting lucky though, which is the weird thing. All right, go, 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 go. It's interesting trying to time it, but I made it, oh, here's the emperor. So, the dragon just wants the great big egg I found on the top of the palace. Very well, it is hidden in my treasure room. room. Return it with my apologies, as long, as long as you're being polite about it. Unless this is a trap. I'm gonna get scared, because I don't know if it's a trap. Um, only my mother knows a code to the treasure room and she's at bingo. Have a look inside, she's always leaving reminders around. I think that the emperor would have control of, you know, a lot of stuff, but apparently not. All right, what's going on here? Oh, I gotta make it match up with the dragons, right? So let's go ahead, dragon. Well, maybe I don't. Um, I thought it was trying to say that, but I guess not. Um, is this just a puzzle I have to guess on? Wait, what is this gonna bring me to? Ah, maybe, ooh, I get it. Okay, then my other says that if I'm not switched on, that if I'm not switched on, then it will end in pandemonium. If I'm not switched on, what? Pandas, pandemonium. Uh, I have no idea what he means by that. That was a weird, I guess they're like ancient Chinese proverbs or something like that, right? I sort of get it, but it's also sort of weird. Yeah, let's get up here. Cause there is another prize up over yonder. Hmm. Yeah, let's try to get up here a little bit. Ready? Oh, no, no, no! Oh no. Will this button reset everything? I think so. Uh okay, there it goes. Oh, I get it. This button pulls that lever. Oh, that's actually a cool little idea. I never thought about something. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh my gosh. Luckily it is here, this idea. So, there you go. Let's lower it one more time. We got this. We got this. But yeah, it's interesting how similar and feel this is a little bit fun one. I mean, it really is supposed to be the portable version of it, but with just its own little bits of, okay, I'll be right back. Hey, go, I at least got that. Honestly, I might try that strategy again here in a moment. I'm just gonna hop on the lever, and then hop off the lever. Wait, well, come on, I did it a second ago. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Ooh. The, since the physics are a little bit different, it is way easier to do than you would be able to in Little Big Planet 1, and I messed it up. Come on, I got it up there. Just like that, make this jump. Okay, you can't land on the panda, that's good. And then what will this button do? Oh, cool, so the first one, the one on the left is gonna be a tiger. Um, I don't exactly wanna give up just yet. I'm gonna lower this back down here. I'm gonna get on over here, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna raise that one up so that we can get that extra prize that you might be able to see over yonder. Ooh, no, are you kidding me? The butt, the, 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 not the button, but the lever, the butt <laughs> got in the way there. That's just not cool. Come on, come on. Here, okay, Mr. Levern. Please either help me get up there or get out of my way. So that is just another circle. I don't know if those are like a sign for something, maybe probably like a music piece or an audio piece or something. Hmm, all right then, thank you. So the first one's a tiger. So before we keep going, let's pop down there so that my memory doesn't fail me. Just like that. So that first one is a tiger, which is the one all the way at the top. Nope, other way, other way. Ready, one, two, three, four, now it's a tiger. All right, then let's go up here and let's try to find out the second one here. What will it be, wait, wait, I got stuff to get here. Do I want to start from the top? 
probably maybe actually let's just yeah okay hold on Ooh. okay i got a few of it i need a little bit more though i just need this one piece i probably wait did i get it oh i guess i did all right then come on now bring me on up and let's see what is up here this is cool, I really like this, it's different. Mother said she'd be amazed if I ever put things away properly. So he is trying to say puns. He's just, he's the emperor of decent jokes. Is that it? Uh oh, what is this, what is this? Oh, I see, it's a maze where I have to uh, put things away properly. <laughs> I get it now, I get it. They are subtle hints, but I wouldn't call them subtle. So even though I just did. What, there's a prize over there. I'm so happy right now, yeah. <laughs> All right, let's just do. Normal motions for this, because I gotta stay focused. Ooh, I got it. Ooh, ooh, you move way too fast for this maze. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's go around this way again. Oh, I can do that nice and quick. Too quick. Luckily, the stuff freezes when you get hit, so sort of have like time to contemplate what you did wrong. Right, come on now, get through here, and boost through there. And... All right, so there's multiple places to go here. Wait, is my jet, my jet pack is maxed out. I can't go that way. Um, what, excuse me? How am I supposed to do it? It wasn't letting me up. Uh, we'll try that one more time. I gotta, I gotta take it slow. I gotta take it so luckily there there's, doesn't seem to be any lives here. So that's good. But, oh wait, 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 there's a jetpack. Ah, I see. All right, and this time I have a little thing now. All right then, cool, cool, cool. So we can go ahead, oh gosh. This is giving memories of Little Big Planet ones you know the desert level, or the canyon level, where you had to do this, and it was just, it wasn't fun. <laughs> it was not fun, it was very, very difficult. You had to like bring the mines through the evil cave of doom. Ouch, death is upon me. Wait, what is this one? Okay, this is the one I got earlier, all right then. So that's fallen. The points actually get in the way, which is odd. Has it always been that way in all the party games? I always figured that points were, I mean, they've been physical objects, but, I don't know, the way that got in the way of the thing there, I've never really seen that before. All right, so we need to get up and around to here. Whoa, almost a little too far. Get this, yep, just like that. Go back down, go back down, and then plop that right here. Nope, <laughs> right, nope, no, hold on, hold on. Uh, why can't I get it anymore, there you go. But also, thank you guys so much for watching this series, and not only that, but commenting your guys' experience on Little Big Planet PSP and just Little Big Planet or, not, or PSP games in general. It's been cool sharing that kind of information with you guys. Oh, I can move this back now. Okay, then I didn't even see this one. Okay, that worked out. But like, it's been really cool, you know, talking to you guys in the comment section about different PSP games you liked, and it gives me great ideas about what I could be doing in the future. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna be doing like PSP game after PSP game, but it would be fun to sprinkle it in there every little while, every few months, maybe get another PSP game in there. But of course, this one's been a lot of fun already. I've been really enjoying it. Let's go ahead, get all of this. Now the question is, how can I get farther? Is there something over here to the left? There is. So we can't go down here, but we can go around here. Get me this frog leg, I think that was. Okay. Oh, that was sort of a trick. I didn't see it there for the last moment of it, so that's my excuse this time. Always gotta have an excuse, right? Oh, and it mashes too. All right then, I got it, don't worry. Um, yeah, Let's go ahead and do that. I get myself a bunch of points and it doesn't even tell me what it is. Um, Excuse me? Oh, okay, so it's the goose or the swan or the goose swan or the swan goose. All right, go down here and get the, the yellow lava one. I'll take that, I'll take that, now we're good. So excuse me, dude. I gotta go down here, and then I'm just gonna take a little bit of a speed boost, okay. As much as I can take it, man. As much as I can take it. Go down here if I can, game, please, game, game, thank you. All right then, so, oh, this one's already there, didn't even have to do it. <laughs> what a waste of time. Waste of time indeed, all right then. Mother says bullseyes, 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 but I'm not really sure what bullseyes have to do with anything. I'm not really sure either. Your mother seems to be a little different than your average mother with speaking in Proverbs. It's like, you just like, it's like, why don't you just say, you know, Johnny, take out the trash, not like, trash must be taken out or you will become trash. You know, it's, it's always so convoluted and complicated, Mom. All right then. Oh, oh, I almost got you there. Oh, don't go away forever. Are you going away forever? No, you're coming back down. All right then. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I need it back down here. 
Ready, set, uh, come on. <laughs> come on, this is tough. This is not an easy thing to stay accurate with, especially when I'm hitting the point and it doesn't count, which is luckily why they don't actually give you like a real timer. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, yes, it worked. Got that recoil shot. All right, got that stuff. I don't see anything else around here, so we're just gonna shoot this straight up. And that bullseye is gonna make everything else disappear. I assume so. All right, I don't see any prize bubbles for this one, so ready, set, boom. Yeah, that wasn't too bad, and that one was the easiest one so far. It's a dragon. I think this one's also on the dragon, so so far we've wasted our time with two of them. I mean, it's still worth doing, of course, because we get prize bubbles and stuff. I just find it funny that's happening to us, because I think that one's already set on dragon as well. Mother says, I will one day grasp the purpose of this room. Do you think that is a clue? Are you now piecing together that these are clues? All right, ooh, yeah, whoa. Okay, I'm guessing that's his mother. All right, get the eyeball, and that's all that's over here. Are these teeth? Because it's sort of kind of creeping. We gotta pull over these flowers over to his ear. Oh boy, bounce. This is before, this is predating bounce pads, by the way. Like, bounce pads did not exist in the game yet. Like, you know, like the tool, the power up, the or not, not a power up, but the, the tool itself, the bounce pads were introduced in Little Big Planet 2, so. Get across it there. So we just like, the first two are definitely the hardest two. Like these ones we can do pretty mindlessly. Just like bouncing around, yada, yada, yada. Not really that hard at all. Or, or maybe it is. I mean, why does this guy got a bunch of flowers in his head? And why does he sort of have like a top hat that's like a part of his head? I don't know, that's a lot of unanswered questions. Just chilling out here. All right, well we gotta be careful. It might actually start flying back up. Huh, that's where the, the difficulty comes in. Okay, ex excuse me, pardon me, I gotta get this through. Come on, so you really do have to pick and choose where you want it. Yeah, get it over there, and that works. Ooh, that's to be nice and high in the air. Come on, get that there. And then two more, and they shouldn't be too bad. All right, so okay, it was a snake. How do I get this So, Oh, it, it squished me, but. <laughs> All right, then the last one's a snake, who would've thunk? I mean, I'm guessing it wasn't gonna be any repeating things, so it's not really all that surprising it was a snake. Okay, let's go ahead and move this. No, wait, I was doing the right way. So let's go ahead, boom, snake, and then let's press the button. Boom. Yes, it worked! The key has given us the egg, and we'll take it. Uh, or, or not. Come on, come on, egg. I'm stuck now. Uh, Can I get through, maybe? Thank you. Give me the egg. Oh, it's working! And so I got the big old egg! <laughs> All right, where's the dragon at? Can I just feed him the egg? I, I think that'd be... Sort of, you know, anticlimactic. Okay, there you go. Hooray, my precious son. When he hatches, I shall name him after you, Sack Dragon. Oh, would you like a lift anywhere? Oh yeah, sure. So wait a minute, hold on. We didn't tell anybody about the carnival. Um, it, I hope it's not over because we didn't tell anybody about the carnival. <laughs> that was our whole job. We're already doing a bad job. All right then. Well, there's level done though. We saved the egg. All right then, so that really did move us on to our new area. And we didn't tell the emperor anything about a carnival. I don't understand that at all, but. <laughs> all right then, so now where are we? We are in the bazaar by the genie. Not too much context on it other than we're here. So why don't we go ahead and head into our first level at the bazaar, which is the cheeky monkey by the genie. All right then, let's hop in. Oh, thank you, dragon. I appreciate it. Uh, ooh, that lamp is so shiny. I am so having that. Hee. <laughs> okay. Uh, am I witnessing a crime? Uh, am I witnessing a crime? Come here. Come here. I'll fight you. Come on. Come on over here. <laughs> I love the emotes in this game. Hold on. Hold on. There has to be something behind it. Really? Nothing? Well, maybe I can climb back up into his mouth here. And then maybe there's like a surprise secret. No? Game, you lead me on here. All right, there has to be something we can do with this thing. Hey, you get back here, monkey. You get right on back here. I'll be getting you when I'm done and getting all these prizes. I like how like, we're angry at this monkey because he's stealing something that's obviously not his, when literally all we do is run around and just pick up random things on the ground. No really collection, or, like, you know, recollection of these are ours or not. Wretched monkey stole my lamp. I'm a Sultan of Zing. Return my lamp to me and I will reward you. Okay, sure. I mean, I think the best reward would be the lamp. So if you can just, you know, toss that over. Maybe I should just take it from the monkey. 
<laughs> Cut out the middleman. Those are cool costumes, though. I am the Monkey Thief King, and I taunt you and your pathetic jumping skills. Oh, I don't know about that. You are taunting the wrong thing. Oh, got that, got that. Oh, wait, we can, wait a minute. Was that a good idea? Uh, I guess so. Okay, what is going on here? Um, oh no, oh no, double oh no, double oh no. Are these, oh, these ones don't spin. Okay, slowly, slowly, catchy monkey. Wait a minute, hold on, hold on, wait a, where is the other stuff I missed out on? This is a little weird, this is like, there's just so much going on. And oh, and now it's like pinball. Okay, thank you. Launch me up, launch me up. One more time, thank you. So this is really weird, I have to say. <laughs> There's just like a lot to take in. I'm not as sure exactly where we're supposed to go. I guess it's supposed to be like a multi-path kind of thing. But that's just sort of like off-putting. It's like I don't really know where truly to go. All right, try to go back through here and I can't actually push through, so. That's all I can do for right now. I sort of messed up my chances with everything else. I talked to Mr. Monkey over here. Don't have any more interest with him. Ow, that hurt. Well, there goes the race. Ooh, go. No! <laughs> Almost got hit on my head there. That wouldn't have been cool. All right, let's try this. Oh, my. Oh, my. No, come on! <laughs> We're ready to go. All right, come on. Get up here. And that was a bad idea. That was a bad idea. Go now. I was thought I was gonna turn the other way. Oh no. <laughs> the physics aren't as easy to master in this game just because, I don't know, it's different. All right then, not that slow, loose. Okay, now you're just rude. I mean, I, I can tell that you are the Thief King, but why did it be the Jerk King? Like, I mean, isn't it good just to be a king of one thing and let others do the work? Don't spread yourself too thin there, dude, or you're Insults might start becoming a little lacking. I mean, I'm sure there's something you could have done that's a little more insulting. Oh, there you go. Whoa, well, what is that? Oh, there's totally some secrets up there. All right, give me those secrets. Wow. Ooh, indeed there was. Two stuff. Two things. <laughs> Two stuff. Ooh, why are we going this way? What about the other stuff? Um, well, this is odd. Uh, oh. Oh, they're, okay. That's what I was just supposed to wait for that. Hmm, all right then. Wait for that, goo, goo, goo. Oh no! <laughs> that barely worked dead. look at these guys. Oh gosh, that's a little big planet one style enemy. I love it. All right, launch me up. I love how they, you know, they reuse some of the ideas from Little Big Planet one, but they did it sort of like in their own form, their own idea, their own vision, and I like that, I appreciate it. Here. Bounce me up, hold on. Bounce me up over time, got it. Okay, how am I getting up there? Just like that. That's some good stuff right there. So we're doing okay with getting stuff. I don't think we've yet to 100% a level after like the tutorials, so hopefully we do at some point, but probably not. You know, if we haven't done it yet, we're probably not doing it at all. Oh darn, come on. One last time, got it. I right, see so there's a ton of stuff up here. So I'm trying to find out which thing would be best to get right now, probably all of this. Ooh. Unleash the things, give them to me. Thank you, I appreciate it. All right, big jump to over here. Now, these levels have been a little bit longer for sure though. Um, is somebody blowing up a balloon? What was that about? All right, yeah, let's go through here. And, oh, uh, wow, you are as nimble as a monkey, a dead one, ha ha. You really are just a jerk. I mean, I get it from a thief king, you know, you're gonna, you're, oh, there were snakes. That makes a lot more sense than, you know, like inflating a balloon. Oh, I got it, I got it, ow. Hmm. We can handle this, I think this will be fine. Just plop, whoa, laggy snake. Uh, the game can't handle the snake anymore. Just that one, <laughs> just that one is laggy. Maybe he's supposed to be slow, but the game doesn't have good enough frame rate for him to be slow. I mean, the, the faster snake under him has a faster frame rate for sure. I don't know what's up there, but no, this one's really quick. Come on, whoa. All right then, get this stuff. Eggplants, really? Get a whole bunch of fruit, tulips, eggplants, watermelon, a bunch of plants, a bunch of fruit. No, I was supposed to get that. Wait, I know I can still get it. Ooh, hey, I got it, and I'm still hanging on. Nice, all right then, what is up there? There's something up there. You're gonna come over here for me, buddy? Okay, <laughs> that worked out, I didn't die. Uh, I guess I could've, no, I couldn't've. 
I thought I'm expecting to be able to like ride them with the enemies, but I guess that's not the goal here. Right, I'm gonna wait for this, grab it, and then go. That was a bad idea. <laughs> Could read that that was a bit bad idea, like right before I let go. You know, it's just like, oh no, what have I done? Ooh no, I gotta wait for it to time out just right. It's actually really hard to. It's just not really working. Oh, okay, there you go, there you go. Big jump. Yeah, I made it, I made it. Okay, what are we gonna do about this? Not really sure. Bounce, and then bounce again. There's a lot of stuff to get here. A lot of points. Okay, I'm trying to land right here. There you go. All right, say, so, oh, give it up, Slack boy. You'll never find my thieves in. Okay, that's a little more creative, I will admit. Come on over here. He at least leaves us with points. I mean, that's courteous. Either that or he's dropping them. And there we go. We have lost him for now, but soon enough, he's gonna begin a little bit of this. <laughs> I love that. Oh, he's trying to meditate. It's not gonna work if you're this mad. Ah. All right then, so what are the other ones? Like, you'll sleep when you're like in that position. What about this one? You start doing jumping jacks. Weird. So there we go. We have saved a baby dragon egg, and then we moved over to the bazaar. And we tried to chase a monkey who had a, a genie lamp. Nice to know. In the next episode, we'll be heading into the thieves' den, which will be very interesting. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Little Big Planet PSP. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give this video a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Monkey so I know you've watched the end of the video and that you're a Zebra Tastic viewer. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.